Greetings and salutations, welcome back to our Let's Play of U4 with Red Bastard. We are playing as Andalusia. Go ahead and upgrade this fleet while we have the cash. Just merge them together. And set them to repair. Couldn't pull this fleet into port. I need about a hundred more ducats. Yeah, Castile's gonna have to start performing better if they're gonna have any hope. I think all their troops are abroad. Okay, so they don't have any colonies over here. They've got this that we can take from them. And that might be something that we want to do. Go ahead and just get that. And do we want religious? We could get religious. We already have humanist. We can get administrative, but I think we'll get economic. Two hundred ducats. I've got twenty two war score. And we haven't even captured these forts. Haven't even knocked their allies in Europe out of the war. Uh, looks like Savoy didn't didn't join in. So that's really good. I think some of these are repaired, yeah. Let me get these ships over here. We're out of manpower. Got plenty of sailors. Got some cash. But our subjects are probably pretty deep in debt. Two thousand in debt. Military power? Sure. Ahead of time. But we'll save up because by the time we get enough to tech up, we probably won't be too far ahead of time. It's the first time I've seen them do a really major counter offensive. Transport. Hmm. 
Yeah, all we need to do is repair these ships a little bit more. And then I'll do a landing over here. So I'm going to force uh, Portugal and Castile to break their lines. Let's see, do I have armies over here still? I do not. Just unfortunate because I need to kill those. Now, well, hopefully, we have time. Looks like we have time. 55 months. More months and these will be repaired. We'll make a landing here. And I think we'll leave one army in Italy. Nice. One army in Spain. And we'll drop one of these off in the New World. Trying to fall behind here. We won't grab this idea. We've got land over here. that back. Uh, no, that's not gonna work. We'll wait till we capture this. Okay, we got a big ship out of that and two transports. Pick up this army, drop it off the new world. And I don't think the Pope will be too thrilled about this. Let's see if we can just piece them out. Really, all I'm going to do to them is just ensure that they lose their alliance with Castile. It will actually will land up here. I'll just kill the rebels. And I think we'll probably march up the Portuguese capital. Rather than trying to engage their army, we'll just try to take their capital, knock them out of the war. Okay, we got that fort, so let's go back up here. We've got one army in Italy, one army in Iberia. We've got one headed towards New World. That's on our colony in progress. And Tunis should be able to wipe out that army. Hey, okay, lots of rebels up here. No, we don't care about religion there is shifting. Long store dimmy, so we don't want to do that anymore. Let's 
kill you. And they're in pretty good shape, but we'll just finish repairing completely. And now try to kill off some of these ships. Columbia. We'll enforce peace on that. Just as soon as I capture this fort. Because then we'll just stack wipe the French. Okay, so Roma is ours. We're going to get off of Rome and start occupying this stuff. Tax is going up. Okay, toe is in our hands. Move down here. Okay. Blame your subject for this, France. And then we should start colonizing another province here. So we do have a colony in progress, so this guy, he just can't get to it. Okay, so France's army is gone. Let's see if we can peace out Pope. I'm not going to ask for too much. I just want him to break his alliance with Castile and probably give us his money. Okay, 400 ducats. You may no longer be allied with him. See if we can isolate him further. Well, that's all we really wanted. Now we got 56 war score, their enthusiasm is low. War scroll stretch even further once we can beat up on Portugal. We gotta deal with these rebels first. Let's check on that of subjects. Cody's got 2,000. They're still, still dealing with their issue. Push front forward more. Toulouse is in our hands. Kill these guys. Wow. We got three siege.
Okay, we can't get there because of this. Which is crazy. That's our fort. Things going up here. Okay, we should just go straight over here. Think moreover, we're just gonna force march our way up here. And then for this, we're just gonna get a merc. Actually, two marks. Bring this guy down here for a sec, pull him out. Put another mark down here. I think we're okay over here. Just gotta liberate some territory here. He's making good progress. It won't take him too long to get over there. Yeah, he is kind of helping liberate this stuff. Not completely, but he is a little bit. So. That'll be good. I think it's starting to get close, yeah. 33 months. Plus that. Move this guy down here. Move them together. I don't think we're gonna move on to... Sicily. Oh, hey, they got eaten by Britain. Okay, they're starting to move back. I'm not sure if they sense the danger coming or what they're doing. Might just be chasing those guys. You never know. There. And we are really low on manpower. The big chunk of the war score here is Portugal. We really need to take French Columbia's capital. So, once we're done with Portugal, we'll use that army in Colombia. I'm worried about mountains up here. The enemy's sitting on them. We're just going to rush through. Hopefully ignoring everything. Get on that capital, siege it out. And then try to weaken Portugal. Can't have liked that. They just lost like 4,000. Oh, that is a woods. Let's not hit them. Well, looks like we're going to. Oh, we don't have enough manpower for this.
Okay, we're gonna move south. That way we can get some mercs. It's pretty painful. Well, could we get Portugal out? I think we could get Portugal out. So now we have 93 war score. That's much better. Okay. Almost restored order. We don't want to waste these marks, so we'll move them down here. Pull this guy back. So, what do we want here? Of course, they have to end their alliance with Portugal. We already stripped them of their Alliance of the Papacy. We're going to take those forts. It's ED3 over extension. What's that fort? 97. I think that might be all the land we can take from them. Okay, so we don't want them to have Avignon. We chose a fort. We'll give it back to France, but we're at, you know, we're not going to give France back anything because we're at war with France currently. Free access. Let's see Mexico. We'll take that. Just a slow bit of land. Hey, it's something. Oh, we don't have any forts over there. Let's see, do they have anything else around the world? Yeah, I really wouldn't be able to protect that. I think that's pretty good. It puts him in a really bad strategic position over here. Okay, Leto's got this cheapo fort. We'll get rid of that. Let's move up here. These guys are exiled, so we'll move them back over here. Uh, this is a mountain fort. I kind of like it. I'll keep that fort. This one really needs to be upgraded or destroyed. Oh, I should have taken that mountain fort too. Okay, so we added that in. Let's give that to our merchant guilds. Convert it. And yeah, I think I think that looks pretty good. Let's give that to our Ulama. And we might as well give one of these forts to our mirrors. Well, is there anything that we can actually give them? Give them that. Okay, we'll convert it when we get the chance. Okay, so we're low on manpower. Really low. This war is basically over. Put these guys back to safety. And our fleet is down here. So 
Let's send that there. Yeah, we've weathered that war pretty well. Got 50 war score. We're not the war leader here. Nor is France. Otherwise, I think France would would want to peace out. These guys down there. We'll see who has debt. Yeah, they're losing this war pretty decisively. Uh, but we can enforce peace because it's our colony that's the aggressor. And I think Portugal will now have a lot more problems trying to keep their people loyal. 80%. 84%. I'm just surprised that there's no outside support yet. Down here. I don't know where their army is. Yeah, we'll spend ducats take on some debt, but we got rid of a bunch of their war exhaustion, like ten of it. And of course, they'll have a period of peace once we're done here. I think Castile's pretty much done. They're pretty broken. And the only reason why Aragon is at all still uh, loyal to him is because we broke them this time as well. Okay, I'd like to have more troops here. Six thousand more marks. And then we'll save up for some money to pay off the debt of our subjects. Okay, let's land down here. That's the war goal. It's occupied by mixed tech. Our subject is the aggressor, though. Ooh, back there. They weren't done recruiting yet. Let's make sure that we have our best general in the job. Hopefully they're not back here trying to protect their, their capital. I 
think, yeah, they're over there. So I think we should have a chance to capture their capital. Once that happens, they should probably sue for peace. Plus the walls, 35% chance. Surrendering. Let's top off relations with two of our allies. Because we haven't done that in some time. Okay, now our subject does control this again. Oh, British Mexico, they took over of whoever was there. Hurry up. So I don't see them over there. They're probably coming back over here. Yeah, they are. We really need to capture this. Mountains, they can certainly kill us. Okay, there we are. Mountains. As long as we control it, we'll be fine. Attack. And they will suffer if they do. Try to bait them onto it. Okay, so Zuni's done, but it's the wrong culture and religion. As long as they work together, they can kill those rebels. Of course, we'll leave this army over here. I didn't even realize that they still had stuff over here. Yeah, they lost some lands here to Portuguese Brazil. Hoping Portuguese Brazil gets freed. And then I'll just attack them. Ulama went some more. Give him that. Yeah, our country's looking pretty tough. Keep an eye on our time. 33 minutes. We'll stop.